Happy Friday, guys. Yeah, we got three dimmers. The optic gate over here. Now we got these on full power, so you can see. Get that Optic 4XL. Let's take a look at some of these cob lights, man. Still killing it with the high yield, the bug quality. This is definitely still my favorite light of all time. I like a lot of lights, but this Optic 8 goes way back. These American-made cobs that last forever. If you look close, you can see two cool whites, and then you have the three over here, and then the three over here. Those are daylight white. There you go. Here's a 4XL. Boom. And what do we got over here? More cob lights, man. This Optic 6, bad to the bone. Recently updated to 605 watts, and the 4XL is running at 500 watts. The 8 Plus is 550. So 605 watts is a lot of power. What's really cool about this, it actually has three dimmers in the light. Or excuse me, three drivers. It has two dimmers, but three drivers. 750 watts of meanwhile drivers. And we're only running them at 605 watts, underdriven. Optic engineers lights that perform better, last longer, shine brighter, more efficient, higher yielding, better components, 10 year warranty. Look at that solderless cob holder and dimmers. Do your bloom enhancers have dimmers? Do you have a touch screen so you can dim your lights up and down, right? So I just turned the bloom enhancers off. Let's turn them back on. Got the cobs up a little bit. And I can say, you know what? We're gonna switch it over to manual mode here. Look at that beautiful light. Look at that. And, and when I actually dim these all the way down, when I dim it all, they shut off. So I plug in here at the top port, and then the bottom port, it goes from here to the next light. And the same thing, you repeat, boom, boom, boom. But look at that. What a beautiful light. Optic LED makes lights that look equally as amazing as they perform. So there it is, guys. It's Cobb Day. Happy Friday Cobb Day. These are the 1XL dimmables. I love these. Look at that. 100 watt Cobb on a dimmer. Boom. $200. Super affordable. Four of those in a 4x4 tent with one of these bloom enhancers would be smashing it. Here we go, let's go ahead and fire those back up, right? How cool is that? You can have a two, four, and six all on the same touch screen. But if you remember, I flipped it into manual mode. So now we got it back into controller mode. We'll turn it off, we'll turn them all on together. Cobs, bloom enhancers. And I got this touch screen running these. It's Friday, it's Cob day. Hey man, grams per watt, the biggest plants with the thickest stalk and stems. Grow those supersized plants with those big fat huge cola buds, man. These cobs are killing it, dude. That's why optics still rocking them hard. Look at this, man. This light is so beautiful. Look at that. Look at that 4XL. What a beautiful light. The same thing over here. I come over here, manual mode, when I dim it all the way down, it, this is the only one that stays on even when you dim it down all the way like that. Bloom enhancers. 
for days. There's so many Blumenhancers on here now. 550 watts. Extremely powerful. So much par. There's no point in cranking more power to this. When you got this sucker two feet up, the amount of par is incredible. A lot of the commercial guys are running these lights two and a half feet above the canopy because these cobs are high par penetration machines. The amount of par that's emitted from these cobs is very impressive. So there it is. Happy Friday to you all. Let me know what's your favorite cob light. We've got the 8 Plus, the 4XL, and these bad boys over here. Make it a great day, guys. Enjoy your weekend. Spark one. Cheers.